In this video, we're going to talk about how to set up your gradebook in Canvas. So the structure of your gradebook. Um, oddly enough, in Canvas, that is, this all happens in assignments rather than in your gradebook. So go ahead and find the tab that says assignments in your course. So by default, Canvas calculates by points. So every time you create an assignment, a discussion forum that is graded, or a quiz that is graded, it all ends up in your assignments tab. So here is my assignments tab. And typically anything that has an assignment has some kind of grade point or grade weight associated with it. So by default, Canvas just counts all those points up and divides it by um, the number of points that you have and figures out the grade. So for some faculty, this is this is fine. This is how they work and calculate grades. Um, but for others, if you are somebody who assigns weights to your um, different categories within your course, so maybe you assign um, 25 points to homework and 15 points to class participation and exams are worth a certain percentage, then you need to set your gradebook up differently. So the first thing you'll need to do is create groups. So by clicking on the button, doing the plus group, you'll give your group a name. So we might call this exams. I might call another one participation. So whatever those groups are that you need to assign a weight to, you need to create a group for. Um, so you go ahead, um, maybe I'm gonna do discussions. And that's, uh, we'll do one more, we'll do tests. So again, the names are irreverent, they're just, they don't matter at all. It's just whatever you would like to call them, I could change them up. So now I need to assign the um, percentages to each of these categories. So to do that, I need to click on the kebab in the top right and choose assignment groups weight. And it pops up a little dialog box. I'm going to check the box that says weight final grade based on assignment groups. And then I would dole out my points uh, based on whatever assignment uh, structure I have going on there. Uh, they should total 100 at the end. And then press save. So by default, again, Canvas counts points. And then if you want to use categories or weights, um, you need to set up your groups and then add the weights. Now, one important thing to keep in mind, um, it's if you look at this homework assignment category, for example, where I have this test assignment that's worth 100 points. Let me just zoom in a little bit. I have this test assignment worth at 100 points and then another assignment worth five and another worth 20. Canvas is going to weight those assignments differently. It's going to give more weight to the assignments that are worth 100 points than the assignment worth five or 20 points. So it's going to average, it's going to not average, it's going to like push the weights out based on how many points there were. So it's going to give more weight to the, the bigger assignments. So it's really important to um, keep the point value consistent within a group. So don't do a fancy thing where like one assignment is worth 30% and then all the rest are worth something else. If you need to do that, then I would break out the categories, push them out, figure out what that one test is worth and make its own group worth whatever percent that is. Um, you'll have to do a little math if that's the case. Um, but um, that is how you set up the grades in Canvas.